Pyromians. I'm Drushnik. Thank you for being here and welcome back to another episode, episode number 10 already, of the Grumi Collective in our Stellaris Federations series. Now, is this this break in continuity bothering you as much as it is bothering me? <laughs> this is terrible. Like, what? Why? Would it be fixed if I would take Gothia? I wonder. Anyway, we do need to look at some administration before we continue our playthrough. Now, what do we need? We have a lot of mineral income, so I'm going to make some alloy foundries here. And then on Orchid, I would like a temple, but we might need to get civilian industries first. Nah, let's get a temple. Let's just go for it. Everybody needs to worship... I don't know who. The Sentinels, I think. Now, Orange Tulip will need a job soon as well. Mm, the food. Definitely food. Anthurium? Nope. Fine. Lycan isn't gonna be in need of jobs. Generator? Purpurium? You need a city district. Okay, so let's see. Why why are you doing this to me, game? Where's the other construction ship over here? Uh, did we just get Saul? We got Saul. Sweet. There we go. Build all the things and the stuffs. Okay. Now, if they come in with their 1k fleet here, I can take them on. No problem. We have 3k over here. And surely they have bigger things to worry about than me, because this fleet is scary. But this is a fully upgraded station. So there's no System way that, complete. that they uh, distress signal that these guys can take that. That's a little bit problematic. So who died? Scientist Petals of Black. Okay, well... You weren't doing anything, Petals of Black. So... That's weird. Oh, you must have been a governor before- I mean, a, a leader before. Um, we are colonizing right now. So let's do uh, colonization fever first. We're not really expanding much. We were before, but now that we've got Mostly have got what we wanted. I'm pleased. Let's uh, take Gothia though, after you are done here. And then Zer. Are they just gonna go all around? I mean, I don't care. Because that means that the Prakiti will have to go through Emor territory before they can get to me. So you just keep going over there, that's fine. That's totally fine. The signal we intercepted was a distress call from a ship in orbit around a Klinda 3. The ship is not giving off any heat signatures and seems to be drifting. A special project has been issued to investigate what has happened to the crew. In at ring. Situation log updated. Research. Oh, whoa, whoa. What are you doing? Construction complete. So are you, are you, are you continuing here? Special your... project complete. They are, aren't they? Come on, boys. The crew of the ship has been found dead. Oh, that's scary. Have I ever seen- this is- this is new, isn't it? I've never seen this before. What is more disturbing is that they appear to have been killed by some highly advanced brain parasites, which infested them and drove them mad. Thanks to Science Officer Petals of Green's findings, we were able to protect our own crew from being infected. Well, I hope so. I hope so. Otherwise, I'm gonna be scared. So you have- Dude, 2k and 1.8- oh, wow. They're strong. I love you. <laughs> love me long time. <laughs> I'm a cute plant. Nobody wants to kill cute plants, right? No, 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 no. Oh, an aggressive admiral. Yes, petals of burgundy. Hello. You can come here too. Just so that we're safe. <laughs> They're all... Hey, you forgot Fire and Bulba. But that's okay. 
Are you gonna go to Kibben? Yes, they are. They're continuing their efforts. System survey complete. Unusual energy readings. Oh, wow, hello. Um, oh, we don't have 5k. We probably need 5k. No, 2000. Okay, next time it's 5k. Yes, extend our deal with the curators because we can use all the research we can get. So, you never had a fight, did you? So, where is their fleet? Is it in Azroth? We can't settle the status quo yet. But we will be soon. I'm Special very proud of your, your thing. At long last, our scientists have penetrated the outer material of the alien box. The three small vials inside are indeed filled with different liquids. One red, one blue, and one green. The liquids are less alien than their container, and our scientists have identified them as primed gene modification mediums. For reasons beyond our understanding, the solutions are quickly deteriorating outside their alien container. But there should be enough time to synthesize and apply one of them to our species. It has been confirmed that its effects would be positive, but exactly how remains to be seen. So we can use the red solution, the green one, the blue one, or we can sell them for a thousand energy credits and 500 minerals. Now, it's been a while since I've gotten this anomaly, this, this event, and I don't actually remember anymore what red, green, and blue did. So, seeing as we are plants, it would be logical to grow, go for the green one, which would be my first go, but seeing as this is the diplomatic expansion and we are going for federations, which usually have a blue color, we could also go for blue. I'm definitely not choosing red. That's a distinctly non-plant-like color, right? I mean, it's a, it's a color of flowers, yes, but we are not flowers. Green or blue? Green or blue? Green or blue? What would Rumi do? I'm gonna go for blue. To celebrate federations. What do we get? The blue gene modification solution has been successfully administered to the Grumi people. Based on preliminary observations, the solution appears to increase our potential lifespan. Yay! Hmm. Well. Should have gone for green, I suppose. Oh, my dog just farted. It's very stinky. We have traced the unusual electro electromagnetic radiation emanating from Nastia B2 to a secret subterranean bunker hiding a mega computer to the size of a battleship. Whoa, I can hardly breathe here. Good lord. Our researchers suspect that it may have been there for several thousand years, hard at work solving a single very complex problem, the nature of which still eludes us. When the crew attempted to interact with the computer, they discovered that the facility, which had appeared both abandoned and unguarded, was in fact operated by a security AI, the highest purpose of which seems to be frying its visitors alive. Well, that's the best purpose you can have. As the crew def defeated the AI, did you hear it? I almost wanted to make a poop-related word. It broadcasted a message to an unknown recipient. I don't know what it is, but when that dog sleeps, she just farts all over the place. Let it continue its mysterious calculations. Influence! Special project complete. The drones and their tireless, endless work of extracting ever-diminishing resources from their local planetoids make for a somewhat dull, but nevertheless informative subject of study. In fact, mining networks on New Leaf could stand to learn a thing or two about maximizing mineral extraction rates while conserving energy. Additionally, we have found that the drones are not completely silent. They emit signal pings, though extremely infrequently and at a wavelength hard to isolate from background noise. If there is an anyone left to receive these pings may be a mystery for another time. Mm, ah, mining state. Yes, fascinating automata. Extra mi minerals, please. You're building that observation post. I think after that you can go back to rule. You're getting Gothia, we'll get Zur, and we can get these guys as well. We got some moats there. Really, really nice trade value. 
Agokapas already has the trade hubs, doesn't it? Yes, it does. What's going on over here? Okay, Ilkahans and the Dendrakians don't like each other. But you love me, right? Yes? <laughs> Overwhelming. That's bad. Wait, I'm not improving relations with you? <gasps> Construction Yes, I am. Oh, but it's not doing anything. Oh, that's problematic. Hey, do you still love me? Hey, they've retreated. So they're going over to Kibbin, and that's it. Huh. But that's now only 850. I'm pretty sure that's at 2k. We might be able to defeat it, though. With our second fleet. We could try. I mean, I'm gonna have to reinforce again, but why not try? Let's now build the massive yeah, industries. Hmm. Anomaly found. Looking down. Okay. When you're done, look up. <laughs> Bad pun central. What's that? Reinforcements in transit. Yep, that's fine. Bad pun central. Oh, I can level up too. Dude. Really? You 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 forgot that you sigh. Okay, uh Mizar, you're getting upgraded soonish. Whenever I can. I'm not very smart, am I? <laughs> I completely forgot about that. I mean they will have to go through now Imorza territory before they can reach me, unless they're here. But still. Yeah, I really love these guys now. Do we have uh, egalitarians and pacifists? We are xenophiles and spiritualists, so we're not really the same. That's a little unfortunate. What research are we researching complete. here? Ener engineering research from researchers. And we just got what? Ooh, the planetary capital. Yes. I do like Starbase Cap. I also like faction influence gain, though. Oh, and... Oh, command limit. Oh, this is hard. Command limit. I need to protect myself against these little cute lizards. Cute little... Poopsie toopsie lizards. They're so adorable. Um... Why, are you, why didn't you tell me that you could do that? I had to actually click on the planet before you told me that that was possible. What is your 50%? Ooh, yeah, that, that's not good enough. Do we have another planet in here? complete. Oh, yes, we do. Ridigus. Oh, that 24 continental world. Oh, we need we need to get to... Marik? We need to get to Marik. We do, don't we? That's how many jumps away? One. Two, three. That's not much. Okay, after you're done with that, let's let's forget about that for a second. You can you can make the energy thing. But then we're going to break. Uh -huh. Since our initial settlement of Purpurium, several anomalies in the planet's biosphere have been discovered. The ecosystem is unstable and is not developed according to projected models for a world of this type. Our scientists sus blah, 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 scientists suspect. A scientist suspect. Outside tampering, <laughs> these suspicions have now been confirmed. A few of our colonists have stumbled upon a large underground terraforming complex that was built thousands of years ago. The equipment was apparently deactivated in the middle of the terraforming process, leaving the planet's biosphere in its current unfinished state. If we supply enough power, we should be able to reactivate the machinery. There is no telling what the end result will be like, however. Who could have built this? Situation log updated. Okay, hang on. I want to look at the state of the galaxy. These guys have closed their borders to everybody but me. <laughs> That's interesting. No, and also not to the People's Republic of Imorza. So we, the three of us could be a nice federation of, of uh, some... Of you feathered friends. I'm not feathered. Uh, okay. 
How about you guys? You with the hearts and the flag. But being a despotic empire. Hmm, hmm, hmm. You don't know anybody, anybody that I don't know. I want to know more. You just went through them and expanded. I know that you two like each other. You also don't know anybody extra. That makes me sad and upset. I want to know more on empires. I do like the Bojo Knights. How are you with the others that I like? Oh, yeah. Yeah, look, look, look. Oh, so the three of us could be a federal. Oh. Okay. Boulder Knights, Emor Zot, Grumi Collective, and maybe Fire Tribes of Yihim. That could be one federation. We could crush the Tendrakians. These guys could do whatever they want to do. Yes. I can totally see this happening. Totally. Totes. We will, of course, be nice to the Sol Solians. I want to... Technologically enlighten them. Construction complete. Of course. Duh. Come on. You're part of our our origin story now. I don't know how long it'll take. They they were in Iron Age, right? So it's gonna take a while. Where are you now? Look, could they have a pyramid? Stone palace. Which, uh, where can I see that again? Don't remember. Oh, late medieval. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna take a while. That's okay. We've got time. I'll, uh, chill the beer for ya. Well, they probably already have beer. What is the ISIS fluttering leaf? What the eyes is flutteringly found on Impaltov 3 were not buildings, but surprisingly regular mineral outcroppings. Science officer Petals of Green asserts that these angular blocks of rock are the product of interactions between tectonic plates. Their shape's the result of the unusual tectonophysics inherent in the planet's crust. The inherent... the, <clears throat> the perfect angularity of these thrust faults implies a possibility of aliens tampering with Impaltov 3's crust at some point in the past. In a ring. If I may say so myself. Now I do like this world too. But we can't get there. <laughs> well we could if we kill these guys. Hmm. We can't do it now though. How are you liking your life now, huh? You like it? You like it? Oh, whoa, did you see the name of that? Uh, look, Troom Dalon. Almost roomy. Not quite, but almost. I just wanted to show that to you. <laughs> System survey complete. Oh, man. Okay, uh, I don't really need you guys, do I? I mean, you're weak, too. That's okay, though. I forgive you. There's nothing really special here but the curator Clean orders, aggressors. though. Ooh, aliens. Mm -hmm. What are you? Oh, the amoeba. Okay. There was a planet there, too. Tropical World 15 size. Mmm. Yummy. Whoa. You, you did the bad thing. Okay, so what are we researching on all three? Okay, we're almost done here. This has been delayed and delayed and delayed. We do need it. We do need this. 53 months, though. Ha! Huh, the research is taking forever! New frontiers established. But I do want to... Yeah, let's let's just do this real quick. The Sentinels, I want to know. A single badly scorched module is all that is left of a Cybrex research station that once orbited Amastis 4, hundreds of thousands of years ago. The vacuum exposed inside of the module is filled with the dead remains of creatures that are part machine and part organic. Eh. Research. An insult from the pre -KKK. Research complete. One ton of use? No, no, no. It has become clear to us that your willingness to embrace alien cultures in the Grimmy Collective is because you never fostered one of your own. Let's let's insult them back. Hang on. I do love insults. What are we going to say? The pre is a nation of fools worthy of nothing but contempt. No, I want a better one. 
Our patience with your prejudices against other cultures is wearing thin. When will you be civilized enough to truly join the interest? Is that... That is the weakest insult I've ever seen. Come on, you can do better. The narrow-minded ignorance of the Prikikiti has blinded you. Do you not realize this? Okay, we plants are really bad at insults. Okay, this is better. We consider the Prikikiti to be one of the great accidents of the galaxy. It should never have been. Well. Okay, I guess that uh, xenophiles are not really good at insulting others. <laughs> that makes sense, sort of, doesn't it? Ooh, hello. 400% shield damage? Yeah, but I need research. <laughs> Get that next. I was just about to say, come to mama. But I didn't. I did not. They're fighting. Stop fighting! Ilkahans and the Tendrakians. Okay, yeah, 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 that's fine. I don't care. You have no orders. Are you already starting your construction? Well, I'm guessing, though, that getting here is higher priority than getting Xur, although I do want these alloys. Hmm. Whispers and rumors concerning possible ties to organized crime, uh-oh, have surrounded Governor Franz Burgundy for some time now. The governor has dismissed these claims as malicious libel? Invented by political rivals, but recent evidence suggests there may be more to it than that. Oh dear, he's corrupt. Hey, you have nothing to do. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hang on, because we have a lot of work for you. We do. We do, we do, we do. We did get this, right? Yes, we did. Okay, track all on map. Right? Okay. Mm, well, before all the borders close. I, st I saw burritos again. Oh, oh, you can go... Okay, well, go here first. Then go to burritos. Then go to Valdop. Then here. Yeah, we'll do the other ones with a different size ship. Oh, hello. I just want to play and every time something happens. Clearing away the rubble is a painstakingly painstaking and risky business. Workers and equipment have to be hoisted down hundreds of meters to the dig site. And excavated rubble has to be lifted out. There have been numerous casualties and accidents while working in these trying conditions. But progress is being made. And every day we venture deeper. The walls of the crater are worn and cracked by time, but they plunge unerringly, straight down into the planet's core. We can still only speculate how deep it goes, as something in the depths is garbling all our sensor readings. Scary! So did you... Oh, maybe I'm paused. Okay, now they're going... Yeah, they are... Ooh, hello. Can I play too? I'll come in when you... When you're... When you've taken System care of them. System survey complete. And since I'm closest... Special project complete. Shouldn't I get the system? <laughs> An analysis of the Cybrex research module we found above Amasis 4 has revealed that the machine consciousness was experimenting with cybernetic life forms. Hundreds of unfortunate prisoners were transported to this facility for the purpose of having their limbs and organs replaced with various mechanical contraptions. The exact ob objectives of these tests remain unclear. There is no evidence that the Cybrex ever made use of the cybernetic units outside this lab. Wow. After intense study of our recovered Cybrex artifact, scientists on New Leaf have managed to deduce the exact galactic coordinates of a system the ancient machines referred to as Cybrex Prime, possibly where their civilization retreated after their abortive attempt to exterminate all sapient organic life. We should launch an expedition to the system before someone else beats us to it. Cybrex Alpha. Sweet. So who's, who's Beiruda going to? Me, 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 Yes! <laughs> I'm the best ally ever. Don't you think? 
we got an 11 ocean world. <laughs> I'm such a good friend. I'm the best friend. Okay, I need another science ship. So, Stimsis. Stimsis? Make me? Science ship. So, hang on, are you gonna go to Zurak now? No, you're not. Okay, I'm gonna go back then too. Are you gonna go? If any of you goes here, I'm gonna follow. No? Okay, fine. Fine. Fine, 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 fine. I'll stay here too. I'm over Starbase Cap now. Am I gonna get rid of Mizar? Mm, I think I can wait. Whoa, 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 hang on. You have nothing to do. Really? Go to automatic exploration. You have nothing to do. Don't really believe that, though. Don't believe it. <sighs> here, we have one here. Yeah. You? You, were ha you had nothing to do. Research. And then you have nothing to do. Oh yeah, you're new. We need... Because we have nobody, right? No. Um, yeah, let's get a... Somebody who's going to get really old. Ooh, look at that, a Tendrakian. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. I mean, we love everybody, but... First, we need to make sure that our own... Has everything and everything, right? Construction complete. Let's see. Oh, you're gonna need jobs soon. I need energy. I do know why I'm over Starbase Cap. Seeing as that not that's not gonna change. Special project complete. Anytime soon. Ooh, hello, I need this. Uh Redwood Colony. Uh oh. I saw something that startled me. Oh, we're, we're, we're continuing gameplay. The Sentinels have woken. Oh no! The engineering team was just preparing to disassemble the broken Sentinel when a gentle shiver passed through the statues, and they sprung to life. Bodies humming and skin glowing. Radiation pulsating from their cores has made them malleable and transparent, revealing a digital grid of limbs. Oh no! Before anyone could react, they had surrounded the archaeologists and suspended them with a force field. Now they wish to speak with us. <clears throat> Hear them out? <laughs> oh! The sentinel with the broken wing returns to one of its peers and speaks. Please, Devana, set them down. I wish to be freed from this prison. I can no longer count the days we have served our masters, toiling on this earth while they enjoy the heavens below. I am alive but dead. They are dead but alive. Will you not let me go? Devana looks at her with disgust. Excelsia by the gods, keep it together. Our loved ones rest below. Have you forgotten our sin? We made a promise to guard their afterlives eternally. That is our only redemption. She sizes us up. You are no threat to us, Grumans. Leave us in peace and we will protect this planet eternally. What are you? You're not gonna answer that? Heaven? She raises one eyebrow and snickers. Our masters are of a refined taste. Well, we are a loving species, so I'm gonna say we accept your protection. Remove archaeological site, add sentinels. Excelsior approaches the archaeologists. Please, I beg of you to end my suffering. Can we trust them? You are free to go. Anything happen in the next days? No. Okay. Oh! That was scary. That was really scary. Hey, we should get Patricor. Why not? 
Anyway, I'm going to cut this episode here. And in the next one, I don't know what will happen. This is getting very exciting. Very eventful. Whew. Well, I hope you're enjoying it too. If you do, and if you did like this episode, hit the like button and please consider subscribing. It helps out immensely. New episodes in the Groomy Collective come out about every other day at 8pm CET. And I will see you next time.